Fester, you were watching Jeopardy last night. Is that correct? I find that as I get older, I watch Jeopardy almost every night. And if I miss it, I'll watch like three or four episodes in a row, like on a weekend. And you have pulled two sound bites from last night's syndicated Jeopardy here in the Tampa Bay area. That's on what, Channel 10? Who hosts yeah. that thing? Uh, well, Maya Bialik is the host right now, and I think she's doing a great job. And Ken Jennings is the other host, right? They split uh, duties, and I right. think they're going to name a, a full-time host, but I like it with Maya and Ken switching back and forth. Jeopardy last night. Fester, this is a Jeopardy question that popped up nationwide. Yes. Because the same episode runs all across the country. Right? Oh, they're not different in every city? No, they're not. All right, here's the Tulsa version. <laughs> uh, what was the question, or what was the category? Uh, dip in the Bay. The category was Dip in the Bay. Yes. All right, here's the audio. Jake, a Dip in the Bay, too. What? How about a Daily Double? Okay. Oh, wow. Did you hear that? It was the... It was the Daily Double. He yeah, heard it. And that just made it... Even more perfect. Yeah, we heard it. All right, Daily Double. Let's listen. Jake. A dip in the bay, too. How about a Daily Double? Okay. <laughs> You're in the lead with 5,800. How much are you going to wager? 3,500. Here's your clue. Wow. The Sunshine Skyway Bridge crosses this body oh. of water, <laughs> sheltered in part from the Gulf of Mexico by the Pinellas Peninsula. Duh. What is Tampa Bay? That's correct. Well done. Oh, look, look at that. Right. Thank you, Blossom. That gives you 9,300. Select again. All right. Now, so. name the three counties involved with the Sunshine Skyway Bridge. Oh. People are like, what, three counties? Yes. The Sunshine Skyway crosses three counties. That's a very specific question, even for Jeopardy. Name the three counties in the state. That ought to be the Daily Double. <laughs> oh, you love or that. The, the Daily Triple. <laughs> Roxanne, do you know what three counties? I'm thinking it's got to be Pinellas, Hillsboro, and Sarasota or Manatee. Pick one. Sarasota, Manatee. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, all right. I know it's one of the two, but I, I'm going to guess Sounds good to Manatee. Me. Yes, Manatee comes before Sarasota. Yeah, I just did yes. the math. I just did yeah. the geography. Yes. Yeah. A lot of people don't realize this, that if you're heading south in Pinellas, you're in Pinellas County when you hit the Skyway. In the middle of the bridge, you've got a sliver of Hillsborough County. Why? Mm-hmm. Is, is that because of like shipping channels? No, it's because of the way the county lines are drawn. It's ridiculous. Right. Well, I'll tell you what's ridiculous is when somebody jumps off the Skyway Bridge, the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office has to respond. Not with the new nets. Yeah. Yeah, right. They put up those new big uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, cargo so that's, nets. No, yeah. That, that's that's good. I mean, I, I feel bad for anyone that is so destitute that they, they resort to that. Yeah. All right. So, yeah. So, you got Pinellas, then Hillsborough County's in the middle of the Skyway, and then when you cross over a little further, then you go into Manatee County. All right. Now, what's the other thing you want to play here, Fester? I don't know if you wanted to play Final Jeopardy. You want to quiz me? I mean, I knew the answer. I guessed oh. it. Oh, you knew it? I did. I and knew then it. we all know I'm it. like that. Oh. I'm like that jackass who, like, I shout answers at the TV, and then and when I get them right, I look at my wife, and she's like, shut up. All right, so this is <laughs> Final Jeopardy? Yes. Uh, it, it, I'll play. I, I thought uh, it was interesting. Did I'll you know this? You. I guessed it. You guessed it correctly. Yes. All right. Hold on. Let me play Final Jeopardy from last night. Less than 100 yards north of the J. Edgar Hoover building is this notorious location. You have 30 seconds. Good luck. I know. Right, I know, so I know, hold, I know. hold on. Hold so on. it's Washington, D.C. Yeah, it was national landmarks right. or historical landmarks was, was the category. Mm-hmm. Less than 100 yards from... The J. Edgar Hoover... Which is the FBI headquarters. Is this, Quantico. Is, is the, the, stop, Roxanne. No, what? First of all, what? I didn't even guess. Stop. Hold on. Roxanne, Did a, just, it was not in the form of your, a question. Your answer is what? What is Clarice? What? what? <laughs> All right. Did you say Quantico? Do you have any idea how Jeopardy works? Quantico is in Virginia, and it's okay. way south of Washington D.C. Continue with your correct answers. All right. So Roxanne is wrong, and you didn't say it in the <laughs> phrase in a, in a question. Gitmo what is, would have been a better. Question. What is <laughs> what is Quantico and Clarice? Yeah, you're right. Guantanamo Bay would have been better. You're right. What is Clarice? What is Clarice? <laughs> so the first person guessed 
the grassy knoll. And of that's course, in Dallas. Yeah, that's wrong. terrible. That's, wow. Dealey, that's Dealey Plaza in, in, where, where Kennedy was oh shot. Oh, my God. Who guessed that? Uh, from the uh, by Leah Harvey Oswald yeah. the, from the Texas Book Depository. All right. Do you know... Oh, oh, let me roll. Let me roll it back again. Right, um, I, 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 I think I we ought to we ought to write it down. You should okay, write it yeah, down. Right, right hold down. on. Do you, so who's playing? So Fessy, you know the answer. I know, I know the answer. Right, for, like, here's a post-it. Hey, give me this. All right, there, there's a post-it. All right, l- let me roll it one more time. Fester's quizzing us to see if we know Final Jeopardy. All right, here we go. Less than 100 yards north of the J. Edgar Hoover Building is this notorious location. You have 30 seconds. Good luck. Get, get I, Froggy I, your pen. He doesn't have I a pen. I, I think I know it. I've, I've just written it down All right. on a post-it. Now, it, it, a couple, so you have to think. It, they, the word notorious is the clue. All right. So let, let, let me let me shut it off here. Notorious is the clue. So uh, less than 100 yards. Uh, here's mine. Right, so here's my guess. Um I, I have two guesses actually, but this is my. You only get one. This is this is my final answer. All right. All right, hold on. So, I got to take MJ's sheet here. All right, Run. now hold on, hold on, Fester. Okay. All right. Now, do you have all the wrong answers? Uh, Andrew, do we pull all the wrong answers? Is it the whole? Is it the whole clip? It's it? the whole clip. Okay, so All keep right. going. Listen so, to the two guesses that are wrong. So okay. the first one that was wrong was in the Dallas. The third one's right. Okay, so who? Somebody said. Play it. Somebody said the grassy. No, right, here it is. Listen. All right. We'll begin with Susie Garver. What did you write down? What is the grassy knoll? What are you, a moron? <laughs> how, wow. how did you get past the screening process on Jeopardy? Uh, the she's grassy. A first of all, she's a teacher. She's a teacher. They say. Less than 100 yards from uh, the the Hoover Bill. What was the J, less than 100 yards from the J Edgar Hoover Building in Washington D.C. Is this no, this notorious site? Wow! Right. And she says the grassy no. All right, that, that is clearly incorrect. That is not correct. No. And how much did you wager? Why did Why did Maya Balalik whatever call her an idiot? You That's are a complete like, moron. Maya Thank you. Gives like a sarcastic, condescending I, laugh, like she laughed because she's a genius. I heard. I heard Listen, her laugh. We need. Rude Jeopardy, right? Yeah, we need Rude Jeopardy, where the host just belittles the contestants when they give you stupid answers. Trebek kept it classy the for so long. Gra- yeah, it's time to step it up a little bit. <laughs> All right. All right, so Grassy Knoll. Grassy Knoll, wrong. That, that is wrong. That, that, Man, you're a clod. That's dumb. Here we go. 4,599. Right. That'll take you down to oh. a dollar. Oh, she's down <laughs> a dollar. <laughs> what an idiot. And listen how she says it. A dollar. A dollar. Yeah, Mayim has this real condescending time. I love it. I like I really like her on the show. Yeah. Jackass. All right, here we go. Next. Jake Marvin, what did you come up with? What is Watergate? Ah, that oh. crossed my mind. Right, okay. Watergate. What, the hotel? Well, the whole well, thing happened the, at the Watergate yeah, Hotel. I know, well, but, okay. it's, it's actually apartments and uh, okay. it was a whole complex. There, so, and Watergate still exists. And, and uh, Forrest Gump was in a room right. across the way <laughs> That's and true. saw the whole thing. So Watergate, I, that did cross my uh, mind. But that, Yeah, we had some guesses on text, yeah, Watergate. That was mm-hmm. not my final answer. Now, keep in mind that Froggy and myself, we have written down our answers. All no, that is man. not correct. Not- and how much did you wager? You wagered it all, all right? That'll take you down to zero and puts you in third place. And Young Shen Wang. Young Shen Wang. Isn't yes. that, that that Chinese dance show? Is his dad old Shen Wang? Listen, he's, he's, this is the second, this will be his second win because he gets it. All right. Now, why don't you open up our guesses? All right. Again, here. Let, Watergate's let, a terrible guess. Now, now hold on. I, hold it's on. not an awful guess, it, it, but it's not right. It ran through my mind. And again, let me just play the setup again. Less than 100 yards north of the J. Edgar Hoover building is this notorious location. You have 30 seconds. Good luck. They don't say Washington, D.C. So J. Edgar you Hoover. You have to know yeah, where the building is. Th- at which that the J. Edgar, that's the FBI building, which is not a very attractive building in Washington, D.C. And <laughs> Fester, would you like to reveal All right. the guesses? Froggy's answer is the Wash Monument, and he drew a picture of it, which which is wildly uh, inappropriate. Wait, wait, wait a wait, second. No, that's, Hold the, that's the monument. Hold it. You drew a picture of the Washington Monument. Well, why is the Washington Monument a notorious site less than 100 yards from the J. Edgar Hoover building? Oh, because it's just it's a monumental? 
and it's very tall. <laughs> I've been why, to the top of it. Why would that be notorious? For notorious? The look at it. All right. <laughs> it's, no. it's Washington's ween. It, it's, it, it is not <laughs> no, no, notorious. Noto- it is then what not do you call it? Just a monument. It's the Washington Monument. There's nothing notorious about the Washington oh, Monument. there's nothing notorious so, wait, about wait, it. When right. you say... Washington's right. not, he's not buried underneath right. it. All right. Fester, right. MJ's so answer. you know. What is my guess? First of all, I love how MJ writes his initial, or writes MJ on his sheet with his right. chicken scratch Cause, handwriting. Cause I don't want to be confused with uh, Froggy the Idiot over here. Okay. How was my drawing, though? Uh, you, you, Wildly accurate. Thank you. Wildly accurate. I put um, bushes on each side. So, uh, again. <laughs> Less than 100 yards north of the J. Edgar Hoover building is this notorious location. You have 30 seconds. All right. And All right. MJ's answer, Ford's Theater. That's terrible. All right. Let's listen. Hold on. Nothing I, I, happened there. He said, what, they manufacture Fords? What? No, it's a theater, Froggy. All right. Let's continue. What did you write down? What is Ford's Theater? That is correct. Uh, the theater where Lincoln was assassinated. How much are we going to add to your score? Nine thousand two hundred one. How can I didn't cheat? Oh, Give me well, a break. I see what Dude, this means. I've been to Ford's Theater. I've seen the Bloody Pillow. Yeah, I, I, have uh, you been to the Washington I, Monument? So, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Well, no, the bloody pillow was not in Ford's theater. It was across the street at that yes. house, the, the, <laughs> the midget bed. Yeah. So where, I went to that too. Where John Wilkes house? No, booth. Yes, where John Wilkes booth. He shot Lincoln in for in uh, Ford's theater, but then Lincoln was taken across the street to that 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 hole. The house. Oh, yeah. And what did he scream when he jumped down? Ah, uh, a two brute. No. He didn't. It wasn't it? No. What do you scream? Who, what's a tuber say? Yeah, you know what? I need to sign up for Jeopardy. He's like, you know what? You're a cheater. You looked it up. You, you no, know what? what do you mean I looked it up? You don't know what's all. You're a Ford Steer, of course. I didn't, I didn't, I, I you don't do anything to make right, yourself Fester, look Did cool. I look anything up? No. Yeah. I, I, okay. not, as far as I know. Uh, I didn't look anything name up. Name a um, more notorious location in Washington, D.C. That's very, very easy. Okay. Name one. Um, there's, there's that one with the, with Abraham Lincoln sitting in that big chair. That's not Lincoln notorious. Lincoln Memorial. It's Monument. the Lincoln Memorial and that's not notorious. All right. But anyway, I was. Etou Brute is Julius Caesar, by the way. But, um, yes, this means that close. Froggy and I work with two Final Jeopardy elitist geniuses. Yeah, is that what are, this means? Yeah. Wow. Well, We're I was cool. just impressed that Tampa Bay was the daily double and then. I thought Final Jeopardy was just good. That's yeah, why just, I pulled it. Just an added bonus yeah. for, I think, Fester just to quiz us. To see I want to play it every day now. <laughs> it's not a terrible idea. What? We can watch the show. Yeah, oh, right? yeah, yeah. If we do the bit, then <laughs> Final Jeopardy every day. You can watch it every night. I got to and... surprise you with yeah, it. Yeah, oh, uh. exactly.